All right, today, uh, welcome back. We have a tick time timer. This is a countdown timer. It goes from 99 minutes down to zero. And um, it can be set for different things. All you do is turn it and it starts from my understanding. So let's take a look at this, open it up and see uh, how it works. Hexagonal shape, we've got uh, three, five, 10, 30, 25 uh, minute timers. So um, you can set it for each of these different times. Let's see how to turn it on and get it working. So we can set the timer to go at a specific, a specific amount, like five minutes and one second. And then we just turn it up here. So I set the timer for five minutes and one second. We can see it's counting down, even though the three side is up. If we want to change this and we want to do exactly uh, five minutes or exactly uh, 15 minutes, all I got to do is switch this over to the 15 and it's going to start over again at 15 minutes and it'll count down from there. So this preset ones, three, five, uh, 15, 10, 25, and 30 minutes uh, for our six different preset ones. This will do a timer up to 99 minutes and 59 seconds, which is uh, an hour and 40 minutes. Um, you can time it up to that much. So if you wanted to set your kid's um, uh, tablet time, for example, um, all you gotta do is, is uh, pick this up. You can change this timing and we can change it up to, if we wanna say 45 minutes. We can set it to any custom time we want up to 99 minutes and 99 seconds. So we go up to 45 minutes and then we start our timer by pushing it down like this so the three side is up and it's going to start counting down from 45 minutes uh, this will also tell you how long you're taking to do a task so we can get rid of that so uh, we can we can put this side face down we watch this bar on the top and we see it's blinking and then uh, if we're uh, working on math problems whatever we want to do we want to see how long it takes us to finish it flip it back over saw that took 15 seconds from the time we turned it over and, until then uh, this would be great for an egg timer turn it over onto your you know three minute eggs Got your three side up it's going to start it at three minutes automatically you want to cook something for five minutes again just put the five side up display is going to change based on that so it's got a counting up timer you don't actually know how long you're counting I'll leave that part out it's got a count up timer and a count down timer so in five minutes this is going to have an, the alarm is going to go off we can set this for a different amount of time again zero it out by picking it up if we want to set this for five seconds, so we'll set it for five seconds and set it down. We can listen to our alarm go off. Should be able to change the volume on our alarm. So it's a lot lower now. So you can see there's the different alarm settings. You can have it as a nice quiet alarm. So we'll pick this back up and see how quiet this is now. Nice gentle alarm. Depends on what you're trying to accomplish. How, how far away you are when you want to hear it. Uh, the charger port is right here on the top. Um, this is for the, the minutes and seconds when you're setting your timer. Uh, when you have, uh, when it's down this way and you want to change your volume, you, this is the volume up and down button as well. So this, these have dual functions. One is for uh, setting the minutes and seconds, and the other is for setting the volume. Charging port right here. It gets a full charge in about uh, one and a half hours and has a 15 day standby time. You can see the different presets here. You got your 30, 25, 15, three, and five. You can custom set it. Uh, you can turn this to uh, top side so it's facing down. And this will tell you, uh, this is a count, counting upward timer. So we can see how long I've had this thing face down if we're trying to uh, complete certain tasks and see how long it takes us. Set it down, 
And then when you're done, you flip it over and you see, oh, that took me 16 seconds to say that. So this is the tick time personal timer. Uh, this only weighs two ounces, so very lightweight. Comes with its own rechargeable batteries, so you don't have to worry about adding your own batteries to it. Um, this is very compact, very portable. Charge it up, take it on a trip with you. You can do several different things. It comes with the charging cord, comes with instructions, and a convenient little box. and a cool geometric shape. To turn it off, we just push these two buttons here and hold them down, and now it's off. So power is off, it's not gonna start timing or anything like that, the battery's not wearing down when we do that. If we wanna turn it back on again, we just push these buttons here again, and there it's on. Just push both the buttons, it'll turn back on. And we can start our timer here, count down. It's been seven seconds that we had it. Um, and then it'll start over again when we want to do it. We can set it for three minutes, just like this. No need to push any special buttons. If you want a three minute timer, all you gotta do is turn it. Um, again, turn it up, it's gonna stop. If we want to do it for a 10 minute timer. Again, just put the 10 side up and we can see it starts counting down from 10 minutes. So again, tick time timer.